I wish to make it unequivocally clear that I will not tolerate any delays to the delivery of this unit. Necessary penalties will be at hand. Should any delays be experienced, heads will roll. Public Enterprises Minister Malusi Gigaba says he won't tolerate any more delays on the Madupi power station. The country doesn't have the luxury of time to brook any delays. We have commitment from our contractors uh, in writing that they will not delay our program for end of the year. And as ESCOM, we will do whatever it takes to make sure that the station is delivered by its target date in December 2013. Minister Malusi Gagaba has met with unions and contractors who've committed to finishing the first phase of the project by the end of 2013. One of the generating units is expected to start producing power by December, which will add 800 megawatts of power to the national grid, something South Africa is desperate for as electricity demands increase. This time year's completion will not only contribute to supporting government's economic growth and development objectives but will further contribute towards ensuring security of electricity supply for the country. Building materials lay scattered on the ground. Construction is well underway even though there have been delays mostly due to labor unrest but it's hoped the whole project will be completed by 2016 adding a total of 4,800 megawatts to the grid. Gia Nicolaides, Eyewitness News, Madupi Power Station. Eyewitness News, in touch, in tune and independent. For the latest, log on to ewn.co.za or ewn.mobi.